Welcome to Manifestant Life. Today is me again sharing about my back obsessions. So I'm just coming back from uh, Malaysia. I just touched down and I had my dinner and everything like that. And I thought to share you uh, what's it, what is in my bag that I carried off with me uh, as my carry-on bag. And also like sort of like my um, one of my favorite bags. In my bag collection. So, without further ado, I will going to show you my bag today. This is the bag. <laughs> so, as y'all know, this design is a very very famous uh, mm, design. I mean, like the bag design, the style. Yeah, the style. That's the word I'm looking for. It's the Proenza Schooler. I hope I pronounce it correctly, but. Yeah, you know the brand. I will type it here and on the title also. This is the PS1 and in the tiny size. So you can see this is like very very bulky because I have a lot of things inside. And I had a medium size one before in the exact same color. I think this is like a little bit like wine red color. So I really really like this color and I love the leather and I sold my medium size away because like it's just sitting around inside my closet and I don't really use it that much because it holds way too much so sometimes when I carry that like it holds a lot but it can hold some of my thing that I wanted to carry if it's a bigger bag I hope you understand what I mean so I just sold it away and I really miss the leather and this is actually also pre-loved that I bought it from Carousel and I think the leather is just in great great condition uh, I don't know how long uh, maybe one year that the pre the previous owner that owned this one uh, but I really really like it because it don't have any like scuffing or any damage damage to the bag so it's just like exactly what my bag was but in the tiny size i actually decided to buy this when i passed by in i think Takash takashimaya some uh one day with my boyfriend and i shop in a shop called i think it's club 21 so they they have it there in the black color but because i have a lot of black color bag i don't want to get any, any other black bag again so um, I just decided to get the exact same one. So I was browsing and I was lucky enough to get the exact exact same color. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't talk. But anyway, so I'm going to share with you what's inside. So as you see, this pom-pom here, this is actually not an access accessory that I uh, hook on the back. It's actually something inside that I put. So I just hang it off. So I just put it away like that. So you can just take it off. Normally, I won't put this in. I, I just carry it this way. Okay. So when I open like that, this is how you open it. It looks small, but it gets actually can hold like a ton you know like most of the thing that I, ca I need to carry with me every day it actually can fit everything inside okay so I will show you the uh, what is inside first before uh, then I will share a little lip review about it okay so now it's very packed so I think this is like a great time to let you know what is inside so you can see I will show you how I pack it it's a lot of things okay so first thing that i see is this <laughs> chocolate brownie that i got from a asia <laughs> fly okay it's actually not very nice in my opinion but i just have a craving for sweet things you know on the plane and <laughs> Second thing is this. I'm not sure if you know what is this. This is actually a little fan. And you can see like the butt here. Okay, so next thing is my phone inside. And you just plug this like on the the hole here. And it's that to turn. So it's like a, a mini fan to me. <laughs> so it's very very handy that my boyfriend got it from Taiwan for me. I think he's very thoughtful and it's small enough and convenient enough for me to carry everywhere. So I just carry that. <laughs> it's very cute, right? I, I love it. Okay, I think this is a brilliant idea. Of course, 
then the third thing is my phone still same in my Luffy cover it's a plastic case because I'm a very very rough user and I think plastic case protects my phone better <laughs> okay so that's that okay <laughs> anyway next is my key the car key I actually rent car in Singapore and this time I'm renting the Toyota Yaris if I'm not wrong uh, yeah because I have some many many errands to run these two days so I just get one car you know so next I have it here is this is my uh, specs cover that I saw from YouTube uh, called Fashionably Amy I saw her videos on uh, sharing about this and I just you know go to the link and I just want to buy it because I lost uh, most of my uh, spec case and I want something like very compact inside my bag but look nice last time I just used this thing you know this is not very nice and it's like not very good quality and I really scared that my spec will be squished inside my bag so this is more like more protection okay this is actually from Etsy if you want this exact uh, bag that I will put the link down below so you can check it out I think it's a very good material um, very uh, high quality for the price because it's really cheap in my opinion and I'm able to put two spec inside actually and I do need two spec with me one is like my sunglass from Newton Light um, special event this is a black color one it's from neutral light I uh, hope you can see okay anyway so this is this then the next one is my empty blu-ray spec that I always carry with me whenever I look uh, do my computer work and you know phone work something like that so I just put it this way like that like this so that I can put this inside the spec the case so it holds these two specs very very well together and it fits in the little bag so I am very satisfied with this purchase next I have my uh, this is the where my I hang my puff uh, pom pom puff Okay, so this is a Louis Vuitton uh, 4 key ring holder in multi color print in white color and inside is just the light pink uh, interior and I also same, I put two bank tokens behind and I'm uh, thinking getting something to carry this instead of putting here because it, it makes my um, my holder very snug or like press against the leather I don't know it feel like very bulky although I only have two keys inside so yeah that's that I love this purchase this is also pretty love from carousel I think carousel is a wonderful app <laughs> thanks for making that app happen in my life next I have this Evian spray of course I will need this in my life in the hazy season in Singapore and Malaysia because I always feel like very heaty, very hot, very dirty you know with all the haze and I can't breathe and I always need to refresh myself with water with mineral good water so this is a must have in Singapore right now and next I have my compact wallet this is from Sambonia Mm, so this is my current wallet that I'm using for compact version and I really really wanted to get the Evasion <laughs> the Louis Vuitton new wallet that the compact wallet but like I say I don't like it when I open it and it open like that you know you need to fold all your bills and where else this wallet is like you can open up and you don't have to fold your bills so I still prefer this kind of design and I not yet found something like that from Louis Vuitton maybe from Chanel but I think Chanel is just not as rough as I can use it you know what I mean like <coughs> I'm very very um, rough user I won't 
like baby my item so I think Louis Vuitton will be a better um, brand for me to get the wallet maybe I have it for another one maybe you can recommend me if you know any Chanel wallet that or any wallet that have this kind of design I think that will be awesome and of course I have my <laughs> photos and cards and everything here and I actually have the Singapore um, anniversary notes that they gave during SG50 I have the 50 notes and the $10 notes it's actually a very very pretty and behind it actually have different uh, diagram of photos in the at the back it's actually very worth collect collecting but yeah I wish my friend didn't give me this because now I have $80 and I cannot use because <laughs> it's worth to keep but I want to spend the money <laughs> but anyway I just keep inside the wallet that's that so next I have my mini pochette in Damia Ibin so this is also pre-love from <laughs> Carousel I find many many things from there I think it's more affordable and I don't mind pre-love item if it's in a very good condition and uh, they don't have like words, uh, weird smell um, so that's the most important if you're buying pre-love item and of course this I have like miscellaneous thing inside like the mouse spray the the phone wire, the cords, like my hand creams, my chopstick, you know, my pens, and USB and everything like that I showed before. And I really love this because of the red lining. Yeah. So this is this. So next I have like <coughs> have like a body key from my company is a meal replacement in my bag it's very very compact and whenever I feel hungry or if I can't to have a proper meal and I will I might need to skip that meal I can prepare myself not to get hungry uh, throughout the day so this is really really good thing that to keep inside my bag and it's very very compact so I love this and next I have this this is like the sunflower canals bar inside my bag so this is like just some snacks so just in case I get hungry again <laughs> so that's that and this is a random bank statement that I got from a bank I asked them to print for me from Malaysia and <laughs> this is my flight ticket the, the flight that I'm taking just now is Air Asia I flew from Penang to Singapore yeah this afternoon this evening I think and I have some coins uh, on the bottom here so this is I think it's a Malaysian ringgit coin okay I dropped something <laughs> okay the next thing I'm going to show is like my compact powder <laughs> then I put it but I dropped it just now I <laughs> hope it didn't break yeah luckily it didn't break so this is my compact powder it's from artistry i really love this powder so it's always with me in my um bag and uh i i always bring like my uh louis vuitton uh cosmetic pouch with me but if i really really need to downsize it i will just need one lipstick and one compact powder that will be done for like whole day so this is this that is able to fit inside the bag also so at the front compartment here that was in the front compartment for the compact powder uh, i have like my passport here i'm currently still pr so i'm holding a malaysian passport okay so i have like my cards that i lazy to put back to the wallet and i have like malaysian uh, ringgit inside that also <laughs> haven't had the chance to put it in my wallet and like i have this this is like <laughs> very special thing it's also from body key it's like the chicken soup powder that if i get hungry again i cannot able to get a warm water and i just put this in and it's a chicken soup for me to drink <laughs> so there's that and some coins again <laughs> at the bottom and also like this is a Malaysian coins okay 
So next, there's a zipper compartment here. Uh, I actually put something like I've got the Maybank, uh, my Maybank bank book, passbook inside. Um, I know like many people don't use this anymore, but I think this is still the best way to track everything in your bank. I think because like I always confused with my bank password, something like that. So. Yeah, that's that. And this time, I do keep like my authenticity card from Proenza Schooler here, and also the receipts and everything. And this previous owner actually bought this bag last year in July. So I think this is still quite a new bag. So yeah, that's that. So in here, it actually say made in Italy. I hope you see and it's like in a rusty gold hardware and here there's uh, this keychain here that says Lorenzo Schooler and at the back is just one plain simple pocket here that I keep oh this is something very <laughs> very Chinese because uh, I went to Malaysia Sungai Petani there's a small town they have having a, a celebration for Chinese uh, the mooncake festival and uh, over there there's this um, god of fortune then he dressed up like a god of fortune and he gave out the lucky number so he asked me to buy this number <laughs> so I hope I can win the lottery and something like that and just put it at the back here <laughs> Okay, so this is very cute in my country. So yeah, sometimes I put like Easling card here or like some change here or money here. It's for easy access. And I think um here is my phone. You can actually uh you you can you can put an iPhone six plus inside, but I think you can put it like that. Although it's not very safe. So you see you only can put like halfway through. So this is not a very big pocket. But I'm able to just maybe put my card. You know, this is a debit card you can just put in. Okay, so or like uh, money. So I just fold that. Like, but I think this is a very convenient compartment for me to uh, use it. But I don't like put things in there permanently because it's not zip whereas the medium one is zip so it's a very very nice bag so a little review and uh it's a <laughs> video is uh, quite long already i i tend to like make very long video i'm so sorry if you find it too uh, lengthy so do let me know okay so this is the hardware that i really love and the design and the style i like it i think it's really really classic and timeless and of course the leather uh, i don't prefer the suede uh, material of the bag because uh, i prefer this leather because i really like leather bags and mm, the first thing uh, when i got this uh, uh, pre-loved bag at home uh, then I actually use a leather cleaner to clean it and uh, moisturize it, condition it so it's not too bad it's actually um, adjustable strap and I'm intended intent to put some more holes this is already like the maximum the shortest length but I still prefer like maybe one two holes more to carry a little bit uh, so, so I have have for some more shots for you so here I will change the place so you can see so here is where it uh, hits like my just my hip so it's a good length but I wish it's a, like a bit shorter like that I think it's better and you can use it like crossbody it's actually a very very good size for crossbody so it hangs this way so but I still prefer like maybe a little bit up so for easy access okay so it's very very like close to your your body so it's actually very very convenient okay and yeah so sometimes i also carry it like this at the crop of my arm i just carry it this way so if i carry it this way i will like because this is very long so i will like turn the the strap and I just carry this way so I just carry it like that 
So one thing about this is I realize it's quite uh, it, it has some weight Although it's very light right now But it has some weight on it Because of the I think the the hardware or something like that I'm not sure but it's still a very very good no, bag I don't really uh, want to buy some bag that I won't be using it a lot and if I really really won't use the bag I will sell it so currently the bag that I have is mostly from my company from Artistry from Neutralite or like the bag that I really really love so of course I'm a bag girl so <laughs> I will like <laughs> I just keep searching and looking for bags non-stop every day uh, that's also kind of like distress uh, ways for me to you know distress myself so yeah i hope you enjoy uh, what's in my bag uh, video uh, sharing thing so if you if i miss out anything and you would like to know you can ask me on, on the comment bar below i would like i would love to reply your message and yeah um they have a lot of hardware details that I really love. It doesn't have any fits, but it also won't be very slouchy. So this is also what I love. And even you are feel that it's very troublesome to keep opening, you can just hang like that. It's still very safe in my opinion because they actually have a class here. It's actually very tight. Okay. And in the medium size, you actually have another class over here. But where the small one, it doesn't have. Maybe it's too small, so it don't need to have. And it's actually the same print inside. Uh, but I don't think this is a, like the must-have in your life. Because I know that there's many, many bags that for is many people must have. It's just that I really love this material, the leather feel, the the style I really like it and I own one in medium size before and I really really miss it after I sew it even now I think I have sewed it for many many months already but I still miss the bag a lot so that's why I decided to get another one in the tiny size although it can't fit too many things that I need like for example scarf that I need every day but I will still love it because it's a very light um how to say not a lightweight bag but it's very compact bag for me to carry around so i love that you know it's because i can get my hands free still looks stylish so yeah thank you for watching guys so if you haven't subscribed already please do so and you can share my video if you love to and if you have anything that you want to ask me feel free to leave comment down below and don't forget don't forget to like my video if you like this bag also okay so I'm very new to YouTube but I really love and enjoy making videos for people and I don't know how people will look uh, at me if they know me but I really want to share something that I love and something that I uh, do adore in my life and this is how Mackie is okay so nice to meet you guys again and thank you for watching I will see you again on my next video bye bye